This is Karen with the Kind Garden Stuff. Today I'm with um, the Urban Worm Bag and Blue Worms. Let's open this up and see. Last week I remember there was condensation on the inside cover. <clears throat> Let's see what there is today. There is condensation on the entire inside cover. don't really like because it gets too wet down here um, but let's check check it out there are some fungus gnats on the side sides there 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 just get them all off all right let's see if I can move this just a bit and let's see how they're doing here Oh, the coffee filter is still here, but uh, looks like they're working on it underneath. There's <clears throat> a um, compostable bag. Oh yeah, this is the one that I put in for a minute. And, in the microwave instead of 30 seconds. So it is being composted nicely. Let's see what else we have here. Swarms throughout. The bedding, despite being super moist, is, well, I can't say that it is super moist because it just, you know, crumbles off. Off my fingers, off my hand, doesn't stay like a big glob, glob. Avocado skin. So that's pretty good. It's well worked over. You can see the dog over here. They're doing well. So, I will feed them up today, give them kind of a big feeding since I'm going to be gone for the next couple weeks. <clears throat> um, now, uh, because this was getting like super wet inside, right now it's, it's wet but not super wet, like I mentioned before. Um, so I uncovered the bottom portion, I'll show it later, but I uncovered, unzipped the bottom portion where the, um, where you do the, um, gosh, I can't even think right now, <laughs> where you do the uh, harvest from. And that has helped quite a bit. <clears throat> Down below, it was pretty much sopping wet. Now it's not sopping wet. It's just it's, well, and it and it never leaked any leachate or anything like that. Um, 
but I could tell it was pretty wet. And I believe because I did that, then the inside is not as wet as it had been. However, like I mentioned before, there is condensation on the inside lid. Anyway, let me go ahead and feed these guys up. filter here. See the level of this bag is increasing. It'll do quite nicely with this for the next few weeks and I won't have to worry about them at all. Okay. Thank you for coming on this journey with me. Oh, let me show you the uh, bottom of the bag. Now it's important See this, when I, it was zipped up initially when I first started the bag, but then I felt uh, the bottom here and it was pretty wet. So I opened the zipper, open that up, make sure that there's a bin underneath to catch any type of liquid or anything that might fall out. And right now it is not as wet as it used to be. So. It needed that air, airflow, to be coming through here. Okay. Anyway, I just wanted to show that to you. Because I was starting to get some liquid buildup here. Along the zipper. Which I didn't really... I've seen some other people where they hadn't opened the zipper part until they were ready to harvest and they couldn't open the zipper. <laughs> so
So I don't want that happening to me. Plus it was super moist inside and uh, even though I'm in a very dry climate, um, it really does need it to breathe. Okay, here we go. And thank you for coming on this journey with me.